Hi, today we are doing a uppercut quality check again, and this one is traveling to United States. So let's get on. Let's start with getting bullets in. That's bullet number one, number two, three, four, five. Okay, that's all six of them, and now let's check the combination between hammer, trigger, and cylinder. So that's one, two, three. Four, five, six, one more. There you go. And the same with the getting bullets out. Number one, number two, number three, number four, number five, and the last one, number six. There you go. That's all it. Okay, then let's speak about the situations that could go wrong and one of them is uh, one of them is that there could be a situation that the uh, hammer is not pulling back so the ideally it would be one click another click that's how hammer should work so in case it's stuck there's there's that means there's something there's a problem with cylinder so cylinder is not turning first of all try it with your hand when you see it's not turning and the main reason why that happens is, is this extractor rod that we use to get bullets out. It locks here at the end, but there's a possibility you leave it outside and it falls inside the cylinder. And as you can see, cylinder is not turning. So you try to pull it. Hammer back, it's not going. It's going one click, other click is not going. So whatever you do, don't put extra pressure. If you put extra, extra pressure, there are small bits inside. I'll show you what's inside. The small bits inside, combination like this inside. And if you pull, when the cylinder is not turning, when you pull, pull hammer back, this will get stuck and this small riddle, little red thing will break off. And there will be no more movement, a uh, combination between hammer, cylinder and trigger. So, like I said, if it gets stuck, try to uh, try with your hand first. As you can see, it's not moving. And if you turn gun around, here you can see structure rod was in, and we are back to business. There you go. So that's one of the that's basically main of the things that uh, usually can go wrong. And the other one is not that common, but still possibility. Like you don't put the bullet fully fully in, and as as again. You see, it's first click, should be one more click, other click is not happening, that means cylinder is stuck. And you again, first of all you check extractor rod, extractor rod is fine, and bullet. Yep, there you go, that was the problem, so bullet in. That's about the, that's the biggest tip I can give you, so just to keep it safe, never, never apply extra pressure and hammer if it's not going. So here you go. Um, Gun is still, gun still can be taken apart, and this is how it's gonna be sent like this. It's gonna be sent like this. So in case you want to add some modifications, engravings, extra colors, or whatever, you can do that very easily because it's a part by part. There you go. So that is quite easy to take apart and put in together is the same thing same thing there you go done not moving so it comes off easily cylinder especially like cylinder you can get off easily but when you put it back on it's stuck it's stuck against this um, it's stuck against this uh, locking bolt this one and locking bolt is a uh, the thing that keeps cylinder from spinning, like you can see these small holes, that's where locking bolt locks in and prevents a cylinder from spinning. So when you put on cylinder, you need that thing to go down. And the way to do it is uh, pulling hammer slightly. You see, when I pull it slightly, it goes back. Not fully, but right in the beginning, it goes down. So slight pull, cylinder on, done. Go and just show it putting together. So this is the part that holds gun together. Like now it slides forwards backwards. When you put this in, done. 
you can't take it apart anymore. So when you receive a gun, if you think, yeah, I'm not gonna modify anything, all you need to do is, uh, from this side, add a little glue here, like wherever on this area, as long as this thing keep, uh, is not falling out, small dot here, and on the other side, tiny small dot here, where it's connected. So, one dot here from other side, and tiny bit here, prefer preferably from inside, so you can't see it. And that's it, then gun will be ready. So, I showed you quality that it works, I, sh I gave you a tip, how not to break it. Okay, then let's go. Let's pack it and send it.